My name's Ray Bonney. I'm a very passionate uh, mental health advocate and also a more passionate men's issues advocate. I've been working in the space for many years and have accumulated so much experience and insight into the space and that helps me get up every single day and what I turn up for is making change and it's changing attitudes and opinions and, and changing lenses on how we view what it feels like being somebody. Getting away from some of those stereotypes and, and, and language around mental health and, and rephrasing into, really, what does it feel like being you? I work with men every single day and the misconception that men don't talk, men don't show their feelings and men don't seek help is bullshit. Can I say that? It's absolute bullshit, they do. It's about creating an environment that pres preserves dignity, preserves pride, and preserves a man's space. Men and women are different biologically. And masculinity at the moment is being absolutely damaged because it's being dismantled one piece at a time. Masculinity is so important. And if we're talking about industries like construction, mining, manufacturing, first responders that are predominantly occupied by men, then they need those masculine traits. What does it feel like being you today as a question? Because what does it feel like, yeah, good, how are you feeling? Yeah, good. But what does it feel like being you today actually requires an answer. So hot, cold, pink, green, blue. Hot when it's freezing cold outside. That's unusual. There's your entree into a conversation. And asking somebody what it feels like gives you a much better opportunity to listen. So when we hear people say, oh, she's just attention seeking, um, she's just crying out for help, yes that person is crying out for help. Yes, they are seeking attention because they want somebody to ask them the question. And almost every day I will ask somebody that question, do you feel like killing yourself? And I don't apologise for that. But the amount of times, especially men, who will just start crying, sorry. No, I'm good, I'm good.